All right, everybody. Here I am again, the 609 Collector. It's been a while since I've posted anything. I've just been so busy, so strapped for time. Um, but I'm going to try and do a quick one before I run off to work. This, <laughs> this is going to be weird. You've seen me before. I did the dollhouse and the ballet studio. The Lori OG accessories. Um, this, this is the modern dining set. These things are actually really, really good accessories. And the reason is because um, the dolls, the creepy little dolls, or whatever height, but the accessories are in like a great one twelfth scale. Uh, they fit really well for Marvel Legends, for Mezco, stuff like that. As you saw, if you've watched the videos for the dollhouse and the video for the ballet studio, one twelfth accessories fit in really well. I don't know if I did a video on it, but I customized the ballet studio. I've had, I've got a few, so I customized one. I um, took everything apart and I repainted it. I got a couple pictures. Um. It came out really well, so I might do that again. But then I found the rest of their accessories work really, really well with the 112 scale stuff. And this one especially. I've got another one, but I got this one. Um, I already opened it and took it apart. So everything's out of the box on that one. But I picked up another one because they were on clearance. You get these at Target. And I got this on clearance for like $9 plus tax. Not important for what I'm doing, Lori. But here on the back, you see this is the... Uh, the penthouse playset, which I wish I had another one because I sent that one off to Canada. Um, you're going to get all this stuff here. A table, this little cool thing, and some dishes. A lot of this stuff you may or may not use. You can have um, some of these set up if you ever want to have a kitchen display. You can chuck it. But you get some pretty cool stuff in here. The chairs, this thing, which is awesome. I'll show you why. And the table. So I'm going to pause real quick, take it out of the box, and then jump back in. All right. Jumping right back in. Now, this is why this little dollhouse set is so great because a lot of people want to have their weapons set up, you know, and you sometimes can't always find the stuff you need. You've got to make the balsa wood tables and stuff like that. This stuff is awesome because once you open it up and get it out, it is in an amazing 1 12th scale. It doesn't have any paint apps to speak of whatsoever. Like I said, this stuff is just extra. I'll glint in the light, but the spoons, the forks are individual. You can have these. You can throw them off to the side. You can use them for a display. You can give them to your kid or your baby sister. You don't really have to use it for anything. You could paint this silver and put uh, some tools in there in case, I don't know, you could use it for like a medical tray. Um, the stitching on these kind of stands out, so you might not want to keep that. But you got plates, glasses, bowls, so anything. The chair, although you can't see it here while he's sitting on it, is this translucent sparkle pink. My little pony-esque thing. Um, yeah, cute. Not really great for your action figures, but you could just paint this. You could paint this black. You can paint it silver. Uh, you can see it glaring in the light. It's it's sparkle to the max, but who cares, man? Your figure can sit in it. When he's sitting in there with the coat, you can't even see. So I got the Punisher next to this, and then I got the weapons on here so you can see. All right, um, well, my flash kind of went down because battery's dying, but that's all right. We're still going to get through this. I just wanted it on initially so you can get all that, um, but you can still see because I got my little light over here throwing some illumination on the situation. All right, so let's get in there. Again, so I'm trying to just, I'm going to pop this off, and we're going to really get in here. Each one of these three drawers here opens up, and you can see. Uh, I'm going to be able to see better from up here that you can fit stuff in there. So if you wanted to put, I don't know, maybe a piece of foam in there and etch it out, you could have that fitting all of the weapons. You can fit handguns in there, stuff like that, magazines, clips, and there's three drawers here on the side. These open up, which is nice because you can open the doors, you can put things in there, claymores, weapons, files, anything you wanna put, you can put in there for display. All right, here for the table, the table's a great size. You see it's big enough to fit this gigantic sniper rifle in there, some shotguns, the assault rifle. It's under there. Again, no paint apps on these, but you can always paint that silver, do black with a silver dry brushing over it. This, you can't see. This has a wood grain to it, which is really, really nice for what this was. You could also paint this. You could do a dark wash and a dry brush on there, something lighter, or you can make it all silver. I was thinking about maybe sanding it down and making it silver, but I might just leave it wood. And I've got few, I think I've got four of these. So you can line these up and then you could um do the thing with a little balsa wood in the netting and you can make your own weapons rack. So really once you have these 
All you need to do is make your own weapons rack, however long, and stack these, and then boom, you've got a weapons rack, you've got drawers. And for me, this is a much better idea and a much better option than spending money on a little armory stuff that is kind of expensive. So if you can find these at your target, I recommend grabbing them or getting them online, whatever you want to do because uh they're, they're pretty cheap and inexpensive and they're like i said they're even clearanced out so they're uh probably not gonna be around for long but as we can see we can stay in punisher right there mezco punisher because he's mezco punisher and you can see how good he looks in front of uh in front of this stuff I put him over here have him looking down you know, I just think this looks really good. So, I'm going to throw this on there. Hopefully, it helped. Um, if you like it, buy some. Hit the like button. Please subscribe. I've just hit over 300 subscribers, which is great because I don't really have that much time to put into this. But because of that, I want to do a little giveaway in the near future to say thank you. And then I want to try and put more into this and hit a few milestones. And maybe, you know, make this a steady thing for myself. All right, guys. Thank you again. Like, subscribe. Catch you later. Peace.